high-pitched cry rips Danny from his peaceful sleep. It shatters the silence like a screaming cat, pierced the deserted streets and bled into the sleeping homes. The warning had been given. Pushing his curtains aside, he peered out into the night. Nothing yet but the bright lights that stab the dark skies. Suddenly, his bedroom door was flung open and his mother hurried in and pushed his slippers towards him. Pull the keys on. We need to head to the shelter. As quickly as she came, she left him. He gathered all his things. He could hear his mother giving the same instructions to his younger sister, Rose. Meeting his mother and sister, they descended the stairs, flicking the lights off as they went. They rushed into the moonlit garden and towards their sunken shelter. The wine was much louder now and the drone of the plane could be heard overhead. Pushing open the door, they sat on the hard benches. Waiting patiently, they heard the unmistakable sound of a plummeting bomb. It whistled as it cut through the sky, landing with a catastrophic boom. The shelter shuddered and groaned around them. That was a big one. Are we safe? Well, the shelter will be just fine. But just in case, let's put on our gas muscle. Outside, the growl of the planes rumbled on after bomb, bomb detonated. Each time the earth seemed to shudder for longer and louder. Dust and dirt crumbled from the roof and littered the floor. They were above them now. They listened in rapt silence. The droning of flames seemed to stop. It wasn't long before they heard the whirring of the all clear. Forcing the door to the shelter open, they stepped out into blinding light. Danny thought it was morning, until he realised what was before him. Where their once beautiful home had stood, was now a burning pile of rubble and fire. Danny gazed, open mouthed around him. Smoke billowed into the sky. Fire raged through the streets and people cried out. Fiery embers illuminated the world. Heat scorched his delicate skin. Gripping his mother's hand, silent tears ran down his sooty face. What now? Now you leave for the country.